that means anything over three miles on I gotta there. pay for it. Yep. yep. So just tell me what it costs. All right, let me go out here and put up my GPS and tell me exactly what's going on with it. Okay. And then we'll get it from there. Okay. I'll, I'll be, be right, right back, hon. Okay. Now, if I got the pull up rod, it looks like it's over off by cl real close to Benton Boulevard over there. It's it, it, it's like if you go down 51st Street. Yep. It's, it's right there. It's off. It's right off 51st Street. Uh, by my G right. By my GPS, it's uh, Scotch at 9.2 miles, so they'll round it up to 10. And you get three of that free. It's 987, so it's 21 dollars to you. Okay. Now, can I do cash or does it have to you be, be cash? You can do a check, you can do a credit card, but if you do a credit card, they will charge you an extra $6 on top of it. I think I got cash. You got change? <laughs> Let's see what I can find. <laughs> and that's how cheap Tripway is. Come over here and I get to tow that thing downtown for $21. Just to give you guys a heads up. Since you guys all think that AAA tow truck drivers make a lot of money, because we don't. If you call a regular tow truck company, they're going to charge you anywhere between $75 to $150 just to hook you up. And you just heard me, I'm doing this for $21. And so now you know why I work eight day, seven days a week, turn in 70 hours a week. A lot of work. And I mainly do it because I enjoy doing what I do. I like helping people. Like hard it is. <laughs> Ooh, well, we're going to have to go out to the truck again. Okay. So how old's your little baby? He's 15 months. <laughs> oh boy, a handful already, right? Yeah. <laughs> nice, so to well, that ain't no good. Now, would you like me to try to get that thing going before I actually tow it? That's fine. I can go grab the key again. Yep. If you want the best price and the best selection, you need to go to Rogers Sporting Goods, the premier place to buy a gun thing. Put it down on the level ground that it helps, or does it even matter? Well, I'm going to put it in neutral and let it roll back some. Because if I can get it going for you, you could drive it and save yourself a dollar.
How long has it been sitting here? Uh, about a week now. So it's been sitting about a week on this hill, and then you came out to start it. It and was up a little further. I rolled it right. down a little bit. And, and then you went to start it, and it was like, off. nope. Yeah. Can't help you. And I didn't want to put it in the street then. Somebody already take the fuel pump out of it? Oh, you can just sit in the passenger oh. seat. It has to go with the car so you can fix it. I ain't trying yet. Of course the battery's dead. Yeah. Of course. I know that's right. Well, these are good vehicles. Has it really? Oh, there you go. So I figured, you know, once I fix everything, it should be all right. That explains it. Because when you get it from auction, all you're doing is getting everybody else's headache. Yeah, exactly. And you never know what you're going to get. That when these things were grip, when these things were brand new, these were badass trucks. But as they got older, down, down where we get, where we can get a hold of them. Pretty much trash. Gas gauge not work on this? Huh? The gas gauge doesn't work on this? Uh, well, I know it's, how we, it's a lot of gas in there. <laughs> Do me a favor. Let me grab, let me, grab me a tool. Let me grab me a special tool. <laughs> you want to hop in the car real quick, huh? And when I tell you, just don't give it no gas. Just turn it over. Okay. And keep cranking. Go ahead. All right. Never mind. Definitely the fuel pump, right? Yep. <laughs> Definitely. But I tried to make a winner out of it. I made it home. When I did, I tried to go back out and it wouldn't start off. And I just moved here. I just went to one thing after a freaking other. Right. Never fails, does it? I can leave the keys in there, right? Oh, yes, ma'am. Go ahead and shut them off, though. That kind of car, is that what we're doing?
Well, ain't this beautiful weather we're having right now? Oh, Come out here and sit out here and be relaxed. Yes, Who wants to eat? Not 100 degrees out here. Just enjoy the day. Yeah, that one was an easy one. Come with me when I'm sitting on the side of the highway and I got trucks past me with about inches by 70. And I, and I don't care how big your stuff is. That shit scribbles up so tight up in you. <laughs> you guys have a good one. I want you now she's got a fuel pump or something laying on the passenger yeah, seat of that. You guys have a good one. <laughs>